so you're part of a group of, of artisans that are that are focused on making uh, more terroir focused Lambrusco, and and how are your wines different from, you know, the the industrial wines? Like, how would you describe the differences? So basically, being organic now uh, is a is a big difference, big difference. Um, and being small as well. So we are a really small company. We produce about 60,000 bottles a year. That is nothing. I mean, um, only my family is working on this company, so that's good as well. And we try just to take what the, the land gives us and to put it in, in the glass. And talk a little bit about the terroir. Yeah, the terroir is really important for us. Um, we are a bit out of Modena city. We are in the southern part, and we are on, on the hills um, between 150, 300 meters above sea level. We got different kind of soil uh, on our countryside. We got silt, uh, we got clay, as we got uh, limestone and sand as well. With our pro products, uh, we try to, um, as I said before, we try to keep the flavor and the characteristic of the lead of the soil, and to put it in, in the bottle as as much as possible. I mean, for somebody that hasn't tried Lambrusco before, how would you describe the taste of it? So basically, you will feel uh, big red fruits smell, perfume coming out straight away when you take the cork out of the bottle. Um, the taste would be basically dry. Uh, we got some sweet one as well, but in my opinion, the Lambrusco Gasparosa is a dry one. And you will feel all these kind of red fruits, uh, like strawberries, cranberries, and stuff like that. And a medium body, a medium big body, talking about uh, Lambrusco, and a kind of frizzy, which is amazing, in my opinion. 